it means a lot for a community to have an open, accessible space that is very community-centric, that does act as this kind of living lab, kind of a crossroads, uh, where all, all members of the community can just drop in, uh, see what's cooking, art-wise, planning-wise, culture-wise, uh, and in, in this space have a chance to actually uh, give some input. And, uh, and, and take something away, and really, really engage and interact with the space. As an artist, it's a great idea because you get sort of the most bang for your buck. You get lots of people going through the space looking at the work. The biggest problem with art galleries in general is that they can just be open for a whole day and no one will come through or one person will come through. It's a great way of guiding people through a space or by a space where there's art happening and they can they can just stop and take a look. I mean, that's really all that you expect of someone when you're an artist is that they just kind of stop and look at the work. And sometimes it's very hard to get people to come to look at the work. So when you put the work in a place where people are always passing through day in and day out, 24 hours a day, and sometimes they need something to do, it's, it's, a, it's a brilliant idea to have a, something for them to look at.